Welcome to 12th of April's Holy Blessing. Supreme Father wants us to become a true Raj Rishi. And in order to do that, we have to know what exactly does he stay in this beautiful blessing. May you be a true Raj Rishi and remain free from attachment to this tasteless world with your attitude of disinterest. A Raj Rishi means to be one with unlimited disinterest while having a kingdom and not to have the slightest attachment to bodies or the old world of bodies because you know that this old world is a tasteless world and has no essence in it. So we have no attachment to a physical body and the things which are related to this physical body which are going to take care of this physical body. Whether it's comfort, whether it's food, whether it's clothes or whether it's anything else which takes care of the body. If we don't have any kind of slightest attachment to it then we are a Raj Rishi. We are using it but we can live without it also because you know that this old world is a tasteless world and has no essence in it so some things which are good today they might be problematic tomorrow some people who are successful and happy today may become may come down in the world tomorrow some people who are helpful today might be someone who become an obstacle tomorrow and someone who's an obstacle today might become a friend tomorrow so it doesn't have any form of form where you can say yes this is the perfect world no God says, it's a tasteless world and has no essence in it. You have found the elevated world of Brahmins in this tasteless world. Where there is happiness, joy, peace, contentment, love in its pure form. No outward appearance but in the true essence. Therefore, you have unlimited disinterest in that world, the old world. That is, there isn't the slightest attachment to it when there isn't any attachment or subservience to anyone or anything or any situation or any behavior or any expectation you would then be called a Raj Rishi or a Tapasvi. Amshan.